No way back. You see what I'm saying? So again, our perception of these things. So they, your sexual immunity system has been compromised. And I'm using that for lack of a better word. My desire is just the other day. I the team awards came out on a stripper hall. And did my thing on a stripper hall. She was 16 years old. All right? That's the part of the reason. See, she's going to be the next one. They don't dry up with Britney. Britney's done. All right? Lady Gaga is going on now. You ever see anything done with Lady Gaga? Everything she's doing, she's covering up her right eyes. She's really into the occult. But Miley Cyrus, and a lot of children watch Hannah Montana. She came out on a TV show on a stripper pole. They did a survey. This is what killed me. They did a survey and asked people where they pissed off about that. And 75% of the people said, they didn't see the movie. See, that's the gauge. They didn't gauge to find out. Should we take Miley and push her to the next? Next thing you know, she's going to come out with new pictures. By accident. You know, that's the new thing, too. Everybody got new pictures, but uh, they were an accident. That's a part of the ritual. When your career hits a spot point, take it off. Take it all off. And watch your career. Come on. You see what happened to Pamela, Am Pamela Anderson? She gave the blueprint for that. And her career took it off. That's a sacrifice. Again, a sacrifice is needed. It may be a physical sacrifice, a sacrifice of your clothes, it may be a sacrifice of a number of things to get work done. So, Miley Cyrus. A uh, 16 year old decided to, okay, you got the human robot connection. Everything is going human on the world tunes. Everybody was sound like a robot and their lines and stuff. Common came out with his latest album called Universal Mind Control. Alright? And you know, transform movies and all of that. So, all of this stuff, again, is playing to where they're going. They're blending everything. Is they're, they're merging realities, so to speak. All right, they are merging realities. All right, they're doing it right up on our face. And again, your perception of it is either going to make it relevant to you or not. So before you criticize these rappers and what's going on, understand that their perception of life is different. They're going to be paying their own costs. They don't want to be working a job for 30, 40 years, waiting for a health care plan and some pension income. They're going to be paid now. They want to party now. And who's to say that they're wrong? So you might go your whole life sitting around being a stiff ass. And they give you in. You never even really know. I'm just telling you to think out of the box. Perception is everything. In certain countries, farting is a form of a compliment. In certain countries. That's like saying I love you. My fellas, you have a problem saying, I love you to your woman? No problem. Go to the people here. Show me love, show me love. All right? So, again, that's perception in certain countries. All right? Um, consciousness or mind control. So, if you've been in this consciousness for 10, 15 years, and it hasn't progressed you in any shape, form, or fashion, maybe you need to get out. Serious business because it turns into a religion. We focus so much on being not a part of religion, we have created a new religion. We want to think alike. See, we want to be infiltrated. We got trigger words that we use. Vibrations of a beloved, this and that. Those are all trigger words. Right? I can listen to somebody's conversation and know what school of thought they came from. Makes you this one, Dr. Gilmore, uh, this, like that. Just fabulous in the conversation. And that's not necessarily a bad thing, but those who are looking to infiltrate the infiltration, they will hear it. Come on. The agents might be in here now. But they have to work their way in. You have to accept them. So they know the lingo. They know the language. They know the way we eat. They know the way we dress. You know, we dress a certain way. We carry a certain vibration about us. And a lot of us are conspiracy theorists. And we go around the line of paranoia. I remember I was super high. Everything was a conspiracy to me. Every day, you see the movie about who was that? I'm going to call it Yeah, everything was a conspiracy until I had to just calm down and say, chill, chill. It's not the same. It's good. Alright, so if you are in this and you are still not looking to walk your own path and you just come to certain events and you can feel like you're out of the box and thinking, then maybe you are in a box. You move from one realm into another. Be careful. 
And what was the matter with New York right now? I'm embarrassed. All right? In the conscious community in New York City, right now, I'm embarrassed. I'm just going to put that on tape. And you know, they call us a cult, you know, stuff like that. So think about it. All right? 